What's up YouTube, Jeff back again today, another very exciting Samsung video for you guys. Today, we finally have the unlocked Galaxy S23 Ultra getting the first, and yes, I said first, because there's another one to come this month, security update from Samsung. I'm gonna talk about that. I'm gonna talk about the second update that's gonna be coming, what you should expect to see that fix later this month, and also the version number and my impressions overall of the software. So before we do that, I wanna remind you guys, if you are gonna be pre-ordering a device from Samsung at the August or July unpacked event in a couple months, I do have mystery boxes open for the Z Fold 5, Z Flip 5, Galaxy Watch 6 Pro. All you gotta do is go to my website, sign up, choose the device that you're gonna be pre-ordering, add it to cards, 100% free, uh, $0. I cover the shipping, everything like that. Uh, you can actually see here in the cart, if you add one to cart, it's 100% free. You get a free case, cleaning kit, a bunch of other accessories. All you have to do is use my link from Samsung to order and then send proof of purchase at the time of the pre-orders. All the information is on my website, so go ahead and give it a read. I encourage you guys to sign up. We've had a hugely successful mystery box program in the past, and I'm looking forward to making it a big success again. Link will be in the pinned comment description. You guys can also check it out uh, up here. I'll have a little QR code you can scan. Uh, and then also, the paid app review program is still going on. If you wanna review some apps for me and get paid to do it, I pay between 25 and 100 bucks. You can sign up on the website. I get in touch with a few people every month to go ahead and review some apps. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Uh, I did receive this morning, this is May 9th, the software update for the Galaxy S23 Ultra unlock device. And so if we go in here, so if we go into software update right here, you guys can see right here, last update, you can see One UI version 5.1, and you can see down here the information, size 395.95, and it is May 1st, 2023 security patch. This ends in AWC9, which I believe, let me actually just double check, is the same one. I don't, I don't see why it wouldn't be. I felt like this update was a little smaller than the one I got on my carrier locked one, but let's go ahead and check really quick. Uh, let's go software information. This one also ends in AWC9. So my locked AT&T model has the same ending number. So this update is not a huge update. I already made a quick video on it. It's mainly got a bunch of security fixes and small minor bug fixes. There don't appear to be any new features with this update. Uh, I have noticed using the AT&T one, and I just got this one, so I can't say too much about the battery life on this device yet, but the battery life does seem to be maybe a little bit improved. That always can be just a little bit of a placebo effect when you first install a new software. I also always clear my cache and everything when I install a brand new software update, even if it's a small one. Um, and then I also notice usually a little boost in fluency, but you know, that's probably not necessarily just from the software update making everything smoother. It's also from clearing the cache. So I encourage you to go and check your unlock device. A lot of people were commenting on the video I did about the AT&T model last week saying they hadn't got it yet on the unlock device. So I encourage you to go in here, software update, download and install, and check for updates. You can see there's nothing really significant, but the good news is that we are going to get a second Galaxy S23 Ultra software update in May. And there's a couple of things that appear to be in the pipeline for Samsung to fix. The first thing, which Sam Mobile posted about last week, is the HDR fix. A lot of people have noticed HDR issues with the Galaxy S23 camera experience in certain lighting conditions, particularly when you're doing low light conditions or in super bright conditions. And Ice Universe over on Twitter confirmed that there is going to be a second May 2023 software update for the S23 Ultra that will be targeted at fixing this. So we can pretty much guarantee that at some point in the second half of the month, most likely, we're going to see this update roll out. Now there's also a post by Sam Mobile yesterday and some other people who do leaks for Samsung uh, in fact, not just Leaksters, but also Samsung's own software development team on the Samsung forums have revealed that the Galaxy S23 Ultra will get an optimized two times zoom option for videos. Now, they just said that this would occur in a future update. They never said particularly when this would occur. So if you read through the story, the person on the Samsung community um, support said that there would be a two times zoom option added to videos that's improved and it's gonna use the optimal sensor um, when it does the two times zoom. So basically it's going to use the center 50 megapixel resolution crop from the large 200 megapixel sensor to get better zoom in videos. Now, we don't know if this is going to come with the two times zoom in portrait mode and HDR fix that we mentioned previously, but it would make sense that if Samsung is testing all of these things that we might potentially see them all in this May update that's gonna be in the second half of the month. 
if we do see that, this would be an absolutely huge update because it would have a lot of camera fixes and some new features as well. And of course, the usual optimization, security patches, etc., that we already got in this first update. Either way, Regardless, this is absolutely awesome that Samsung continues to bring us updates, not just once, but sometimes twice a month. They really improved their track record, and I think they're actually the best Android OEM when it comes to updates. They're even better than Google with the Pixel line, in my personal opinion. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification icon for future videos like this. Go check out those updates. Let me know if you got them. If you want to sign up and review some apps for me, check out the link. If you're pre-ordering the Z Fold 5, Z Flip 5, check out the link also for the mystery boxes below. Appreciate you guys checking it out. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks a lot for watching.